Okay, hello everyone. Uh, this video is just to show you how to unlock the Reaper uh, before Endwalker. Actually, I will unlock it today. Uh, and in order to do that, you don't need that much thing. You need a level one Fisher. So this is how we do. And you need to access to Limsa or Minsa also. So the thing is, you're going to just uh, get tons of fishes from Limsa or Minsa. Um, when I say tons of fishes, that means really tons of fishes. Actually, I caught so many, and maybe I won't be able to get a single one now. Oh, okay, no, it's still working. Good. I was a bit worried because we got this thing on the screen saying you cannot get any more fish. You see, the fish have become wary of your presence. I, it's okay. Um, the thing is, you need to get tons. When I say tons, is uh, maybe yeah, more than 1,000 of fish is 1,500, I think, is what you need. Uh, if you didn't start before, so it, it takes a bit of time, uh, but it's fine. It's fine. You will also need lots of leaves. Uh, the problem of leaves is that you can only get 100 at a time, and you need a bit less than 17 days to refill them fully. Uh, so actually, okay, if you didn't start at all, you won't be ready for Endwalker because I think you need like um, 80 days. And Endwalker, by the time I'm recording this video, would be released in 60 days or even a bit less. So once you get your tons of fishes, you speak to this guy here, Nimsa, you go to Fieldcraft Leaves, and you check the level 1 and 5. And typically, all the fishes you need for this level 1 to 5 leaves can be cooked in this uh, fishing place where I was, so very next to this guy. And then once it's done, you need to return the leaves to uh, Runsif Wilf, which is a guy next to the Guild of Culinarians, I think. Uh, and you talk to him, and you give him his damn fish. Uh, if you're lazy, you can also buy all these fishes, because, I mean, that's low-level fishes. They cost nothing at the market board. So you return them all like this. And the thing is, you will need to do that. No, I stop because I don't care. You will need to do that 500 times. So that's a lot. <laughs> that's quite a lot, actually. But yeah, that's the, a that's the way to do. So we just do it. Um, I think I don't have to do it 500. Actually, I started to work on this achievement before the video. So I'm almost done. So that's why I'm recording it now. Uh, OK, so I grab the thing. So you see, I mean, I didn't buy any fish. I just fished a lot at this spot. And yeah, the four, the four leaf quests from level 1 to 5. Uh, just require fishes, which are here, so it's it's not a big deal. So and then the game would be just to do uh, back and forth between the leaf guy and this culinarian here, who require the fishes to be happy. So you see for this one, um, I can continue, but I don't care because what matters is the number of leaves you return. So even if I can return the same fishes three times with this guy, I don't do it because it, it's actually a, a bit of a waste of time. So I don't really want to do it. So 500 times is a lot and uh, you can check the number of leaves I allow once you still have. So you see I, I have 13 left and you need 17 days to get 100. So take that into account uh, if you want the, to be able to do... Oh, you see, okay, one of these leaves requires sea cucumbers here and you cannot catch them from Limsa. 
So in that case, you just don't accept uh, the leave, and that's it. It's, it's not a big problem. You still have three to return. Because you have two level one leaves available, you have two level five leaves available, but you have four different ones from level one and four different ones from level five, so it's kind of random which one they propose to you, but it's not a problem. I mean, that's why you fish everything. So when you fish, don't mush. Uh, you don't want to mush because the fish you get when you mush uh, cannot be exchanged for these leaves. So just catch regular fishes. It's not, uh, it's not a big problem. We're almost done. I think I just need three more if I count it well. And then we'd be at 500. Okay. Close to the end. We are close to the end. Ah, yeah, I think it's uh, uh, Endwalker would be available in like uh, 56 days, if I remember well. And early access even before, like four days before. So yeah, in less than two months, we'll be able to play. So I'm really looking forward to it. If I don't have that many things to do in the game now, except getting the Reaper, what should be done now? Have you missed it? Yeah, here we are in the Outfield 6 achievement. So, what is this if you go into your achievement? I'll go to the relevant last five. So, complete 500 Fieldcraft leaves and locks. The Reaper title. Okay, it's not the job, it's the title, but still, still it's cool. I mean, I, I, I'm going to play, uh, I'm going to play main Reaper once it will be really released in the game. Uh, but, I mean, I have nothing else to do <laughs> before that, so I decided to unlock the Reaper. So I'm officially the Reaper. And that's it. Okay, sorry, it was a bit of a troll video, but at least I'm the Reaper and I don't have to wait in Endwalker before, assuming I'm a real Reaper for now. Uh, I will, <laughs> sorry about that, I will uh, release tonight um, a guide, uh, I will give the link uh, in the video, to unlock, in the description of the video, to unlock uh, Reaper when Endwalker, the real job this time, when Endwalker real arrive and also how to level it from 70 to 80 as fast as possible. I studied all the ways to make experience and I extracted all the analytical formula to really optimize this day one. So yeah, stay tuned and have a good night. Bye.